Hi everyone, my name is Wawa and I'm back for the finals of the Wawa Cricket Tourney round number 10 hosted by Wawa Starcraft and PinoyStarcraft.com Subscribe to YouTube.com slash Wawa Starcraft for more matches and match histories and the least of the series so yes it is going to be between Mineski Strife and Mineski Ender for the final ZVZ clan versus clan here we go game number two or game number one coming right up now it is going to be happening in three two one and go we have here spawning at the top right position of the map it is going to be Mineski Strife spawning as the purple zerg and his opponent is gonna be the pink terran or the pink zerg spawning at the bottom left position is gonna be the hero from manila mineski ender <laughs> i'm not good with that so yeah mineski ender just asking and just confirming if it is still a best of three because he they are usually common or it is usually common to play a best of five in the finals but again it is the wawa cricket tourney and we don't do best of five series so yeah chill and relax and enjoy as we're gonna do this really really quick and it is a zvz matchup we are back here again in Zelnaga caverns ladies and gentlemen very very awesome map Hope you guys like the other guy, other C or other match because we might see the same thing here coming out. But then again, it is like flashback. I'm pretty sure for both players because they did see each other in the finals of the OSG Old School Gamers Grand Prix Grand Finals as well. So I'm pretty sure it's gonna be a little bit of deja vu for both players. But guess who won that series though? It was Mineski Strive or no? Excuse me. It was Mineski Ender who won that series 4-0 zip. It was a best of 7-2. So yeah, Mineski Stripe that got totally owned on that series. So I'm not sure about Mineski Stripe's play right now with ZBZ, but we might see a very big improvement after that. Pretty sure he felt so bad after being swiped 4-0 by his clanmate. So yes, he better do better this time, and he might do better this time, and hopefully he does better this time. As uh, so we're gonna see, ooh going for expansion or not really going for expansion is Mineski Ender and yeah wow this is this actually gives you a, a tell that he's pretty much nervous about Mineski Strife's third play as well so he, that's I think a little bit of uh, worry right there or just a little bit of oh look at this play right there Mineski Strife putting an evil chamber right there in the middle of the attack and forcing a cancel for Mineski Ender so yes and is using to make the Extractor right there on the other side. So, oh, look at this Ender. Oh, gonna be forced out. For, gonna be patrolling the drone there. Not gonna be allowing that drone to make that pylon or that evolution chamber right there. So, Mineski Ender's drone is gonna be running away for his life. So, yes, that's actually a little bit of good harassment right there by Mineski Strife. Forcing a cancel of the extractor. So that, that's gonna delay his gas a little bit. But not that it's not gonna be delayed that much as we do have the Rochewine bin build here as well by Ender. Oh forward spine spine crawler right here by Ender as well. So I'm not sure why he put it so far away though. Hmm. Maybe to prevent any more scouting. That's a, that's the only reason for that I guess. By the way, we're seeing a queen right here being built for both players. But Ender is going for or not re or Strive is not really gonna go for the Rochewine play. He's gonna go for the more aggressive Zergling play. And I'm pretty curious about this if he's gonna be able to pull it off. As a while ago, we saw that Nux went for the circling play and didn't work out well for Ender. As Ender has made the spine crawler right here, very, very forward spine crawler. I'm not sure about this. We'll see, we'll see though. As where is the queen going? Oh, you better be careful. Oh, he's trying to snipe off this overload right here, but he's, that's too far away. So, Strife, very, very amazing job right there. Putting that overload to the the farthest distance that this queen can't reach it in the high ground so yes very, very nice setup and here we go we need to run by right here by this queen our right, by the zerg the zerg is gonna do damage to the queen but they're not gonna do that much damage as oh look at that metabolic boost is already completely right here by Mineski Strive so Ender is gonna be completely trouble didn't go for the wall off right here which they didn't tell to everyone and I didn't and might be bad for Ender if if it if it if it goes uh, if Strive goes for a really really early harassment right here, but then again we are seeing an expansion right here going down for Strive, so very very interesting play right here by Strive. We might see a harassment with spawn or with ex expansion, but then again it's actually a basic play, you know, harass then go for an expansion. That's actually a very very basic play. Oh look at this two queens guarding that ramp with that those roaches right here. So yes, very very good wall of right here by Ender. But then again, wow, he's sadly mistaken. Because there is not going to be a very, there's not going to be an all-in push right here 
by his strife. He's actually making an expansion. So yes, oh, that overlay is going to be spotting that. He's just going to find that, and that's going to be making him really, really upset. I'm pretty sure. And yes, indeed, he's going to be complete, feeling completely a little bit stupid. I guess that he fall for that uh, all-in push right there by Mineski, by Mineski side. But then again, no push coming in, no push coming in at all. Still keeping all those units there, though. Well, better be safe than sorry, anyway, right? Better be safe than sorry. As we do have a lot of Zergnes here traversing the field, so he's just checking up on everything and everything that's happening in the base of Ender right now. As Bainings are moping in here as well for Ender, so Ender, very weird play right here. Maybe those Bainings are just gonna stay there by the ramp. No, he's gonna bring them along with his Roach army. Surprise, surprise. I guess that's a good play whenever those Zergnes go for surround with those Bane or those Roaches. Those Bainings can just easily explode on them. And that's not going to be looking good for those Zerglings as well. A evil Chamber going down and a Roach Warren going down as well for Minesh Tribe. It's a very, very, very weird play right here for both players. Or for Minesh Tribe. Went for the early harassment that forced Ender to make a lot of Roaches. And then again went for the expansion. So, yeah. Also went for the Roach Warren. Now making Spine Crawlers. <laughs> What is up with this play right here? I don't know. We'll see. We'll see how this progresses though. It might, it might be awesome. It might be very, very awesome. And look at that. All oh, that over did go down. It did see everything everything in the base of Ender though. He knows there's some roaches so he didn't need, really need to see those spine crawlers. But anyway, oh look at that. Stripes is going to be able to see those army of Ender. Wow. Where is he going? Where is this army going? I don't know. Wow. Why did he skip around? Why did he go around? I didn't just go for the kill with the Zergnings. So I don't know. That's a really, really big clump of units right there. Might be a really, really risky play right here as we're going to see a run by right here. Counter push right here by Strife. Is he going to go for the counter push? No, he's not. He does have two spine crawlers here though, so spine crawlers better be careful. Oh, Roach is going to come in as well. Wow, look at this. Anders is going to be going for the harassment. Right? He's going to focus around those Roaches. The Roaches are going to go down very, very quickly. As those Bane going to do damage to the Zerglings. Zerglings went down so fast. There's so many roaches right here for Ender. Ender doing so much damage, but then again, those spine crawlers doing damage as well to those roaches. Ender better be careful to stay away from those roaches, but then again, those roaches still too going. Or those ro roaches are still taking damage for those spine crawlers. We're gonna see this pain is running by. Is he gonna do damage to the mineral line? Oh, is he gonna hurt? Oh, why is he going back? Oh, why did he go back? Why? That was a miss. Big, big miss click right there. Five minutes can Oh, transfusion right there before the queen dies. Very, very nicely done right there. Ender, why? Uh, that was such a big mistake. I'm pretty sure he's pretty upset that he missed that painting motion as it was right in the middle of everything. Wow. Very, very unfortunate right there by Miniskin. But then again, he was in the thick of things. He was doing so much things at the same time. He didn't really know what to do. It was his consi what consistently he's doing right now. But then again, there's still a lot of roaches here for his stripe. So he's going to go for the counter push, I guess. But Baronings are going to be hid hiding in the enemy trying to sneak in from behind but then again the spine crawl is right there guarding the mineral line so no harassment coming in right now or no successful baning bus coming in right there I'm pretty sure as we do have a lot of roaches here only a handful of roaches here for Ender. Ender is in big big trouble only one spine crawler guarding this area as well so wow is this gonna be minutes to victor right here oh Ender is gonna be in big big trouble oh what what did the queen do just focus right on one of those roaches yes indeed wow Ender is gonna be completely forced up his ramp again he is going to be losing uh, this Quatchery. Oh wow, actually just got a lot of libraries right there, but then he does no time to make more units. And look at that, Ender says GG, not enough roaches for Ender. Very, very good game right here. Poor Mineski Strive taking game number one and taking one for the team. Very, very good job right here. So game number one goes to Mineski Strive. And game number two is coming right up, guys, so stay tuned for that.